Hello guys, this is the whale shark from Collecta. I recently got it, but now I'm gonna make a review because now a lot of people made this review for this one. I have three more um, Collecta figures, the anglerfish, the bowmouth guitar fish, the, the sawfish, and a few more. So there you go guys. This is my fourth collector figure. I should be getting more. Maybe a basking shark at least. Here is my other sea creatures that belong to other companies. Besides these three collector figures. <laughs> and here is the whale shark. My health and my mood is not really good, so uh, sorry if the video doesn't sound like some other videos that I made. But still, it's pretty cool. Alright, let's start with the coloring. The coloring is pretty good. As you can see, they used the gray whale shark again. Like, it looks soup like grayish blue, I guess. It's more like dark gray. Collector always comes with this tag. I'll remove it first. Alright. We got it off. Alright guys. Time for the back of the video. Um, here. Like the reminiscent whale shark, they used the white dots, which is always correct. Every company uses the white dots. They also have a slightly opened mouth. Here is too dark for the camera to see, but it looks really cool. Alright. I like si viewing it in this side because it looks really cool. This with the stripes, like real whale sharks, except in the stripe part, I have some issues. In here, the stripey parts, not too, not so much dots as I thought it would be, like real whale sharks. But I guess this is a specimen with not a lot of dots. Because all shark, whale sharks, all of these sharks are all unique. None of them have the same um, pat dot pattern. Even if it's so similar, it's just a slight difference. That's why everything is unique. The five gills are collect correct. This is the oldest collector figure. 2011 whale well, shark I have, but I, I just bought it li recently, really recently. This is second-handed whale well, shark, so I'm sorry for the stains, the new stains, so easily stained. The tail is warped and bended, which I don't like about this whale well, shark. But I think thing looks fine. They also came up with the tag, which is pretty weird. Alright, let's look at the sculpt. The sculpt is pretty good. As you can see here, here has like the streamlined body for the current and waves to push in. The lock, the propelling tail, bulky body with a lot of fins. It also has gills sculpted on it and it's pretty deep the brackish eyes and a dot maybe for the ears of course the nostrils in the bar on the barbel place the mouth which is quite deep and it's one of the biggest whale sharks my other whale sharks are either good looking but small or big but really ugly 
So there you have it, a short review for some of the biggest and I guess um, best sea creature models from Collecta. Before we go, I just want to tell you very soon that I will be uh, maybe making more reviews for other Collecta figures. Only one more left to do, but that's why I'm gonna try to get more Collecta figures. And then maybe I'll just review for some of these as well. So bye guys. We'll see you next time. Like and subscribe. If we hit 10 likes, I will show you something really secret. A new thing we got. All of us got. It's not a figure. It's something even cuter and better. Bye guys.